What's going on guys? My name is Jay Shot, and I really do hope you guys are having a great day today. Welcome back guys to another Jay Shot video. Today it's going to be a really special one because we're going to be reacting to the COD Vanguard Worldwide Multiplayer Reveal. It's about to be a banger baby. If you guys want to see more COD Vanguard on the channel then make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new. Let's get right into the reaction of COD Vanguard Multiplayer. Ooh. Call of Duty Vanguard, baby. Let's go. The time is finally here. Welcome to the multiplayer reveal for Call of Duty Vanguard. Okay. I'm Greg Reisdorf, the multiplayer creative What's director going on, Greg? of Hammer Games. At reveal, we saw the rise of Special Forces team, and now we've had our first technical test of Vanguard out in the wild the Champion Hill Alpha. Okay. Our team is hyper-focused on key data points coming out of that test, and thank you for all the valuable feedback. Today, we will show you our vision of the multiplayer experience for Call of Duty Vanguard. On our last Let's project, go. we brought the Brotherhood of World War II soldiers to life in a more traditional approach, which mm. was a great experience. Major Vanguard, throwback. We're taking liberties and risks to deliver something completely fresh, new, and fun. But first, Let's watch the world premiere of Call of Duty Vanguard multiplayer. Yes, let's go. Ooh. Let's go, baby. Warriors. Saboteurs. Assassins. Their lives turned upside down by the right. Each one with an axe to grind. And when we turn them loose, you better believe they're coming out swinging. Whoa, what the heck? That looks sick. Oh, this gun. This gun was great in World War II. Okay, we got that destruction. Oh! Home run, baby. What is that? Is that like a mini RCXD, but it's like a tank? That's funny. Okay. This movement, man, is insane. This is pretty cool, man. I could, like, believe it or not, these trailers, Call of Duty, they never fail to, um, surprise me, you know? Oh my god, the disc gun. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Go little snipes we got. Ooh, the MP40. Oh. 20 maps, okay. I think 16 of them are going to be 6v6, which I'm super stoked for. Oh my god. This is what I'm most actually excited for, the uh, customization. Hopefully, let's pray to god that they bring um, the custom camos back. Oh my god, freaking flamethrower, man. Let's freaking go, dude. That was phenomenal. Okay, day one content and beyond. Sounds good. So we have 20 total maps in the game. That's crazy, man. 16 of them that are working with core, and they're across all locations. And they're, they're western. I love that hotel map and the snow map, which is pretty cool. Pacific. And then the four maps that comprise Champion Hill, which is Airstrip, Market, Courtyard, and Train Yard. I do love how we have found this fresh approach to World War II. We really, really wanted this time to focus on a global warfare and variety of settings. And when you think about the player experience too, let's say you finish a match on Gavutu and you just came from the Pacific Theater. And then what? the next map that loads up is Desert Siege. Well, what did you just say? The so map name? Oh my god. Oh. It's like Gavutu. That was the first technical test of Vanguard. And starting today, you can preload for the beta, 
which has ah, oh, that's sick. That everybody can now experience. I don't know if I'm gonna be playing the PlayStation exclusive access because I don't have a code for that. I pre-ordered the PC version. Gavutu, an eagle's nest. I cannot wait to see all of those players in there. And then we also have combat facing, so you can now experience okay. this huge range from tactical combat all the way up to blitz combat across those modes that are in the beta. Interesting. It's such a different experience between when you're playing with blitz and tactical as well, yeah. because when you're playing blitz, it's just no holds bar. You're going. Okay, that's what I like. Tactical, it's a lower player count, so we're actually increasing the time to engagement in there, and every shot matters. You were able to Ooh. play with it in the filter system, so within quick match play, you are able to be like... Okay, that's that's actually pretty cool. Doing blitz. I remember I'm excited to see what, like, the Kai community has to, um, to pretty much choose within this mode. But having a, a map the size of Red Star feel like shipment if you're having that, that crazy, level of... Really? Is, ...is what's really fun, because it's, it's different maps. So is this going to be, like, the new shipment? I wonder. Because you just get killed and respawn and kill someone else constantly. It's, it's I hope there's like a shipment in this, man. Similar to how like COD World War II had it. In as well. It's a new mode for Vanguard. It's okay. really fun. I'm really excited to see how Patrol mode? Fun. That's pretty interesting. It's essentially the moving hard point that's moving around the map on this track. You're going and you're taking it and as people play it more and more and discover new strategies around it, like there's play the patrol point, hold it down for your team. But that patrol point is moving no matter how many people from your team are on it. So if you're truly, you know, playing as a team, you're going to have people behind the patrol point, in front of it, really locking down those lanes. That mode. I wondered if this is going to be like so a new competitive mode. Ever had. And you're also exploring the entire map. Interesting. I love it so far. The PC experience. Let's go. Hey everyone. That's what I'm hyped hey, for, baby. UI, UX, Dark Red, Dinox. And today I'm here representing Phoenix, bro. the lead PC developer for Let's freaking go! And we are very excited to bring you Call of Duty Vanguard. Phoenix has put together a dedicated and passionate team to push the quality of the PC version each and every year. I'm we so excited for the PC version. For PC community by supporting both the latest hardware technology and also optimizing for the best performance. With Call of Duty Vanguard, you will get the greatest features and improvement that we have built over the years, such as the uncapped frame rate, the ultra wide, and the multi monitor support, and also a lot of settings. Oh, okay. To fully customize your experience throughout the game. And oh my god, that's a lot of settings. We Jesus. Game to be even more Can't wait for that. We Can't wait to set that up, you know? Thickness, improved text readability, and we even added adaptive, ease of few settings to fit your gameplay style. We've also done a okay. work to improve input latency. By using a high-speed camera combined with an Arduino board and an NVIDIA LDAT, it's a device that measures input to photon latency. We were able to identify opportunities to improve reaction time in terms of milliseconds. We have also reworked our autodetect features. As you may know, we optimize all the graphics. So yeah, boys, I'm gonna probably play the beta when the PC beta rolls out, if you know what I mean. Visual experience or aim for the highest frame rates. Lastly, while waiting for okay. the to jump into your party, or during a round transition, we added a setting that reduces the brightness of your other monitors to allow multitasking without missing any of the action. I don't know how to feel we about that one. To talk about in the upcoming months, and we can't wait for you to experience Call of Duty Vanguard on Battle.net. Now I can't wait to hear more, bro. To give you the latest intel on what's coming to Warzone this year. Oh my God! Let's go. The next chapter of Warzone, baby. Amos, what's up, bro? We want to ensure that the feel and character of the game extends beyond the multiplayer experience and into Call of Duty Warzone. I am pleased to announce that there is a brand new Warzone map coming this year, shortly after the launch of Vanguard, and we are going to let's go the Pacific, featuring an entirely new let's go, bro, with all new points of interest. Oh my God! We'll get to traverse the lush landscapes of the island. What? Of extremely cool Yo, this looks sick. It out alongside friends and foes. This map the looks cool. A fresh, new experience for Call of Duty players. By Let's go. No more Verdansk. To create an atmosphere that is vibrant, yes. alive, 
That's what I love to see. This looks sick, man. I hope they introduce, like, new mechanics. Warzone Pacific will share the same tech and engine as Call of Duty Vanguard. This allows for seamless weapon integration okay. and play balance. Fully optimized crossplay, cross progression, and cross gen support will be enabled so that you can play with your friends across different platforms and generations of consoles. But most importantly, we want to say that Warzone Pacific will be the best experience it can be. We will be launching with a multifaceted new anti cheat system. That will be rolled out with the new Let's go, anti sheet baby. We're putting it through the final paces and testing. Oh wow. <laughs> you see that? Oh my god. They literally it's like a band hammer. This map looks sick. Imagine if they had like a Vanguard Warzone beta or some crap. That would be That would be dope. Playlists, limited time events and seasonal events, as well as community celebrations and much more. We look forward to playing with all of you later this year when the Pacific Dude. Really comes online. This looks sick. Oh my we gosh. We appreciate you watching, but there's so much more for our fans to experience from the beta through launch. The beta will be running over the next two weekends, and you can preload on PlayStation starting today. For your first look at live gameplay from Call of Duty Vanguard Core Multiplayer, tune in now to one of your favorite creators from the entire development team around the world. Thank you so much for joining us today. We can't wait to see you in the game. Let's freaking go, dude. All right, boys. That was pretty much it on pretty much the the worldwide reveal. Oh my gosh, I am super stoked to play this. Uh, I probably won't be playing on the PlayStation simply because I didn't pre pre-order it on PlayStation. So, uh, I'm probably gonna have to wait for Weekend 2 to play it on the PC. But, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys want to see more Vanguard, make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new. For the people that are on PlayStation, the Vanguard multiplayer beta starts this weekend. Hopefully, you guys have a lot of fun. Other than that, guys, it's been Jay Shot, and I'm out. Peace.